the 40 day journey with Jesus. Hello, my friends. Today is Good Friday. It is Good Friday because the death of Jesus brought salvation to the world. And that is good news. So it is known as Good Friday. The celebration for today is in two forms. We would have the stations of the cross in the morning. Then at 3 p.m. we would have the veneration of the cross. The veneration of the cross means that we are coming to adore the cross. We are coming to show respect to the cross. We are coming to show honor to the cross. We are coming to revere the cross. When we gather at 3 p.m., we would have the liturgy of the word, we will have the veneration of the cross, and we will receive communion. In the veneration of the cross, we will come one after the other to kneel before the cross, to touch the cross, or to kiss the cross. But because we are in COVID time, we would not kiss the cross. Why are we going to venerate the cross? We are going to venerate the cross because the cross is a sign of victory. Jesus died on the cross to conquer sin and evil. The cross is the power of God over sin and evil. The cross is a symbol of our faith because of the cross. We are known as Christians. The cross is our faith and the cross is our life. So because of this, we will gather to show respect, to show honor, to show reverence. And the priest will carry the cross. He will either sing or say it. And he will lift it up. The cross will be covered. He will lift it and say, Behold the wood of the cross, on which has hung the Savior of the world. And we will respond, Oh, come, let us adore him. So when we gather this afternoon at 3 p.m. to do the veneration of the cross, remember that it was this cross that brought salvation. To the world. We hold the cross of the Lord, fly ye powers of darkness. We hold the cross of the Lord, let us come and adore our Savior. The Legacy of Hope Project needs our support. As children, we can also contribute. Yes, we can. Let's put aside our monies for toffees, chocolates, ice cream, and all others. Put them in your money box or your piggy bank. And at the end of the Lenten season, donate it to help build the pediatric hospital. Make your coins count. God bless you for this generous 